Banner Tale is a crafting RPG game that takes place in Banner City, the home of Yordos. The story starts when a party of protagonists attended Grand Strong that took away our friend and separated Banner City. So now you will go on a journey to find our friend and fix the city. It has some character in the famous mobile game, League of Legends, so the fan could learn more about them. However, it doesn't affect your experience if you don't know them. In this video, I will talk about some helpful guides to new player. First, always carry your bag. In this game, your backpack is also your house. It's a place for crafting and resting. If you go exploring somewhere far away like another island and you don't have your bag, then you cannot set up your home. So try to make a habit of removing your backpack whenever you go out. Next tip is for a Switch player. If you are a PC player and know how this works, please comment below. When you feel lost and don't know where to go next, you can press X and then press directional button to choose the place or a person you want to go to. Your destination will appear on the map. You can also zoom in for a better view. If nothing appears, it means you haven't explored that place yet. Emotion is one of the important factors in the game. You can earn it by eating, collecting, crafting, and they will turn into skill spoils when you sleep. Skill spoils are used for unlocking skill in order to proceed in the game, and throwing a party is the best way to earn them. Please don't waste this on unlocking skill you haven't needed, because later on, skills will charge more points, and it takes time to gain them back. I will always say before I unlock a skill so that I won't regret later. Unlocking skill giving emotion off to increase emotion capacity. So you don't have to rest so often to earn skill support. And you can earn extra offs by decorating your house, like placing windows, flower pots. Portals will teleport you across Banner City. Each journey costs portal yarn. They can be obtained by fishing in root market completing quests or throw a party like new friend fresh. You can make lots of portal yarn with the charge workbench as an unlocking portal needing and magic conductor skill. Every time you remove an object around the house, you will earn back the materials. So check that you are having 3 empty slots in your bag for them. If you accidentally remove with a full bag, the materials will be sent to the post box and you will have to pay 1 star to get an item back. Please be careful when buying from merchants. Every time you select an item, the game automatically chooses the maximum amount you can buy. So always check before you pay. Before ending this video, I will show you some tips when running the food stand and throwing a party. For the food stand, you will need satisfaction point to be able to open. You can wait for them to increase, or you can sell some items using the vending machine and sleep to skip time. Don't forget to collect by pressing Y. If you are about to serve more than 2 dishes, it's best to make more shopping tables. Make some plates first, then prepare the ingredients on each shopping table. This will make prepping food become simpler. For the party, when you are having trouble reaching the goal, don't forget to invite famous yodels. They will cost more mood and friendship points you can earn the points by serving dishes. A famous Yodos ball of party yarn is worth 3 to 5 points, so try to notice when the balls are ready to be collected. Thank you for watching this video. Please hit the like button if you find it helpful. Any questions or tips you want to share, please leave them in the comment section. See you next time.